Hi, I'm the Grumpy Old Dog Lady, a professional dog trainer and senior accredited companion animal behaviorist. Following on from my last video about the burbles and my suggestion to use muzzles, I want to talk about muzzles. Why is there such a reaction from an owner when I suggest please use a muzzle? I get this horrified look and a comment about, oh, I can't do that. It's cruel. Oh, I couldn't put that on my dog. Well, a muzzle is a very nice, easy way of ensuring that your dog cannot attack people or attack another dog. And usually, if a dog is wearing a muzzle, another owner will ensure that they keep away from that dog and even keep their dog away from that dog. So the three muzzles that I know of, the first one is a windsock muzzle. This looks like a windsock that you see at an airfield. However, a little part of the nose does stick out and sometimes if it doesn't fit correctly, the dog can get in a little nip. The next muzzle is what I call a basket type muzzle. This is a woven with much larger holes in it. The dog can pant, you can put treats through, and the dog can even drink with it. The third muzzle is white, usually white, and it's got tiny little holes in it. To me, it looks like the mask that they put on Hannibal Lecter in his movie. That I have never really used because I just find that the basket type muzzle is the one that I recommend. Some places will not sell muzzles, so you might have to buy them online. But to me, the best route to go to try and uh, get dogs under control and in a calm, kind way is to put a muzzle on them.